With the return of a popular West Palm Beach event, Clematis by Night is back after a nearly year-long break. Plenty of protocols and changes in place this time around, of course. As WPTV News Channel 5's Todd Wilson reports, many in attendance say they are so glad to have the option once again. William Gonzalez is happy. He's with his girl, he's outside, and enjoying music during Clematis by Night. Try to be uh, normal again. So enjoy the time outside and this great opportunity to see this video to us. Yep, you heard me right. It's been nearly a year, but Clematis by night is back up and running. I was happy to hear that and I was happy to come. The city of West Palm Beach is calling the relaunch, the revamp fun in 21 campaign. Typically, events take place on the Great Lawn, but this year it's held at the Meyer Amphitheater. And we're big music people. We've supported it since it started. The city says by holding Clematis by night at the amphitheater, it allows them to focus on enforcement of the CDC recommended COVID-19 precautions they put in place. Safeguards include designated pods that can hold up to four people, a capacity of 50% or less in the amphitheater, hand sanitizing stations, and mask enforcement. For Marie Kilpatrick and her family, she says being back outside is the feeling of freedom. Love it. Love the outdoors. Love being around people. We need it. Um, it's invigorating and uh, makes you feel alive again. Alive goes on. The city of West Palm Beach has done an incredible job of bringing back Clematis by night while complying with COVID-19 guidelines. Admission remains free, but reservations are recommended. In West Palm Beach, Todd Wilson, WPTV News Channel 5. Also returning this weekend on Saturday is West Palm's Green Market, another favorite which will include all of the original 90 vendors. 